Hi, I'm Demichak, and today we're talking about Twitch. Now you may be wondering, oh, but Demichak, why are we talking about Twitch? Well, some news has come out about a streamer being banned, and another streamer being banned, and the hypocrisy of it all, as well as Twitch not letting you make fun of mods. Let's get into the news and find out what the hell is going on on Twitch. Okay, so today we're on win.gg.com or whatever, I don't know. Anyway, Twitch streamer Tay Hu Hu, I think that's how you pronounce it, banned because her child showed on stream. Brazilian Twitch streamer Tay Hu Hu has been issued an indefinite ban after her young daughter appeared on stream while Tay Hu Hu was briefly away to pick up food delivery. Twitch has been in the headlines for the most of the year due to controversies relating to bans and DMC strikes. This time a Brazilian streamer following has come under the ban hammer after she briefly left her child unattended in front of the camera. Her daughter briefly showed up on stream and interacted with his chat resulting in an indefinite ban on Tehuhu's channel. Now I want to just point out first minors basically anyone under the age of 13 is not allowed to be on stream so that is a rule break indefinite means she's not banned permanently just indefinite they don't know when she's coming back but she'll probably come back when compared with other trips controversies her ban has been unfair and harsh yes it is unfair and harsh it should have been like a week ban that that seems fair in my opinion not indefinite because you don't know how long it's going to be. Now, she says, I'm shaking with hate. I'm crying so much. Trish ended my evolution as streamer and I almost had 300 views on live and growing so much. Come to YouTube. Your fan base will follow you over if you come to YouTube. They won't ban you for shit like this. The Brazilian streamer hinted at a comparison to the recent ban rendered to by Twitch. To misbehaving. Oh yeah that girl. I'm pretty sure you've heard of her but let's continue. That streamer revealed explicit content on stream. Basically she showed her how should I say privates on stream which isn't allowed which earned her a free day ban from Amazon owned streaming platform. Tehuhu is not the first streamer who has spoken out about the unfair treatment. Yes, reason one why I'll never use my Twitch channel. Most recently Twitch streamer Justin Minx said that her ban over slows was harsh compared to misbehaving's ban. Oh yeah, didn't she use like simple something? Okay, so here we got Minx. Twitch gave a three day ban to a girl who showed her, you know, on stream, but seven days to me for saying words that I didn't even mean in a hostile way. Yeah, I think she meant simp or something. Uh, I don't know. But yeah, that does seem unfair. The three day ban girl, um, that should have been a permanent ban in my opinion. Then it goes on here that whether a minor can stream on Twitch. Long story short, a minor can't. Did Twitch update its terms of service to protect itself from accusations? Twitch's recent change to terms of service most targetly targeted sexism and har harassment. The policy change include banning words simp and incel from the streaming platform. For a while this became the main target of streaming communities beef with Twitch with the words actually being used more than ever before after the announcement. But Twitch users recently noticed another change to the harassment policy that also garnered hate for the company. One Twitch user highlighted the two changes which state that people can no longer tell a streamer their channel is only popular or life unbanned due to favors. She joked that the Twitch community was well aware of why this was slipped into the terms of the service, hinting that Twitch employees were the ones who actually felt under attack. Jessica says, LMAO, we know why Twitch added this to their terms of service. Yes, and I'm going to say it right now, and I expect the ban on Twitch. I don't really care, but Twitch mods are simps. They're massive simps. Now, Twitch has long been under fire for inconsistency to its punishments. It streams as though popular female streamers known for their suggestive content often escaped harsh punishments. Sometimes they weren't banned at all for offenses that left the other streamers with suspended accounts. Yes, the double hypocrisy because of moderator simps. And as you can see, Monkey here says, God, Twitch staff are ironically mega simps. So, yeah, judging from all that, the, the girl, she should have been banned, I reckon, seven days would have been fair. And banned the other girl who 
definitely violated terms, like massive terms. No nudity allowed on Twitch. However, that doesn't matter because female streamers on Twitch who never get banned just get sl slaps on the wrist. And that's bull, in my opinion. Slipping in that you cannot accuse Twitch employees of, of misconduct is bull also when they've been caught doing it. As we know why they added it in, because they don't want to be accused of being mega simps. That's the problem. They don't want to be accused of being mega simps, and they want to get rid of all the accusations. So how do they do it? By adding stuff in terms of service that you'll probably never see. Now we all know they ban simps and incels and versions and a whole lot of other slurs. You can't even say them on Twitch now. So it's stupid in my opinion. It's so stupid. I mean, I just want to say, I have two Twitch channels. I won't be using them now. If I can't say simp on Twitch, I'm not using it. However, it looks like Twitch has just gone down the toilet. That looks like where it's gone. It's gone down the toilet. And in my opinion, I don't care pretty much. Because I will never be using Twitch ever again. Haven't even used it, just have the channels, won't even use it, and yes, I'll probably be expecting a ban after this video, but all in all, it's so stupid, people. It's so stupid, and it looks like Twitch is really going down the toilet. Now, if you did like this content, please leave a like, and as well as also subscribe to the channel for more content as I cover gaming news, pop culture, content creators when they get banned, like this one, and as well as Twitch. I do cover Twitch on this channel, and this is a little bit of Twitch and content creators getting banned. So yeah, and if you did enjoy this video, subscribe, and as well as hit the bell for notifications, and I'll see you all next time. I'm Demijack. Peace!